I'm going to pull up my VM here. Let me open up UFT. And I'm using version 12.0. Yes, this is a trial version, but I want to utilize it as much as I can and check out all the features that I can. And like I said, throughout this process, we will learn together, not only about UFT, but we will learn the amazing keyword driven frameworks that I will supply you guys. So here it is, UFT is now open. And first thing that I want to do is create a new solution. So I go here, new solution. No, I don't want it here. I want to put it here. And I'm going to put it here. Let me create a new project. If some of you guys have seen my folder structure videos, you may understand this folder structure that's going on here. And if you haven't, go check out the videos. They are very good. Something that you will not see in a regular class or in life. A folder structure organization that makes you so efficient and great at being an automation engineer. Very few people teach that. All right, so let me name this. Okay. Create. Got our solution. Now let's add some stuff to it. I want to add a function library. Well, first let's add a test. I'm going to add an API. Actually, yeah, an API test. Let me add a existing test. And I do have my keyword driven framework template, which is the reason why keyword driven frameworks is so amazing. I just dropped this template, modified a little bit, and then it's going to be working. Okay. So I got my template. Let me attach a function library to here. Yes, let's do that. Awesome. So now I got my function library. Let me just open that up. My function library that contains everything. What else? Grab my keyword driven framework. And here's the template. So now I just need to fill out a few things and hopefully have it running pretty soon.